Hello friends, in the last video we completed how to uh, do prompting for profit and loss statement analysis. In this and the next few videos we will see how to analyze the cash flow uh, statement. It is one of the powerful of the three statements but many people do not know how to gather inferences or how to do the analysis. So I will make it simpler by using a uh, prompting in this video but even before you um, learn about prompting i wish you have some overview of the cash flow statement analysis on the screen whatever you see are the um, completed videos the tick marks are the completed videos and the green highlight is the present um, uh, series of present video uh, topic uh, and as i told you you need to understand a bit about a cash flow statement see i'm opening a cash flow statement it has three parts operating activities then investing activities and uh, financial activities you know investing and financing activities so there are a lot of numbers and how do you interpret or gather inferences from these there's a separate topic altogether which can run for uh, hours of videos together but i'm going to make it very very simpler with a little finance background you should be able to make it when it comes to i have i have written even for that i have written a multi-part blog on simplified cash flow statement analysis if you master these blogs you are a master in cash flow analysis so from the same blog i take a few points to um, explain the background so how do how i analyze the cash flow statement the first and foremost this is the blog on cash flow from operating activities the, this blog has all the uh, academic background or the explanation followed by how i do the analysis my first and foremost criteria is the cash flow from operating activities should be positive it shouldn't be negative so my first criteria is cash flow is negative question so the for the sample in hand let me see how cash flow from operating cash flow from operating activities negative so that is a little uncomfortable situation for me then what is the difference between the cash flow and the net income in profit st in the income statement and what is the reason for the difference sir? Uh, you must you must have some background that net profit is not the real profit and cash flow is the real cash which has been generated by the company from its operations okay a higher positive uh, operating cash flow is favorable yes for me it's then there's a lot of trend analysis uh, you can do for five to ten years and so on and these operating activities must be compared with investing and financing activities so putting it all together my um, uh, this thing my framework of constraints will be whether this is negative whether negative or positive what is the reason and then when it comes to investing activities uh, what is the spends on plants and uh, equipments is the cash flow from uh, cf cash flow from operating activities sufficient to cover the investments on plant and equipment in which case it is growing through internal accruals if it is not then this money has to come from the borrowings from the financing activities so all this to put together as a package um, this uh, this is the way i structurally analyze the cash flow statement analysis at a very top level before i deep dive further so in the next video i will show you the prompting and the output that comes from the model which is very very easy and understandable for anyone so till i catch you back in the next video bye friends